YouTube. Happy 2016 National Pipe Smoking Day here in Fall River, Massachusetts at Old Firehouse Smoke Shop. We have a full house here today. Staying remotely, we have the um, Sherlock Holmes Pipe Club of Boston. That they're down. Um, a couple of the local pipe makers are down. So um, we're smoking pipes and trying different tobaccos and drinking bourbon. So it's going to be a good day. Here we go, guys. Full house at Old Firehouse Smoke Shop. Mr. Jason Diaz over there. You too. Thank you. Bob Clark, our local <laughs> pipe maker, doing some work on his bench. Working on a stem. Busy man today. Busy, busy man. Full house with Sherlock Holmes uh, Pipe Club here from Boston. I'll just hang out. Yeah, I'm kind of pipes. Yeah. Little Raymond got a nice bowl. Pipes to choose from here. More than one, huh? Oh yeah, more than one. <coughs> plenty, plenty to choose from here at Old Firehouse. Nice, some Raymond, different tobaccos. John has a nice selection here at the White House. So yeah, we're just kind of hanging out. Lighters. All sorts of different cigar lighters. Little rack here. Stan This is our full walk in humidor. Oh, by the way, guys, I'm smoking my Brigade Calabash. Yeah, this is the um, full walk -in, walk in humidor here at Firehouse. Nice little selection. All sorts of different stuff. I'll just pan around real quick. We won't go over every single cigar brand. We'll be here all day. So just to kind of show you quickly what John has here. It's a nice cigar right there. Humidifier. Yeah, so there's a lot to choose from here. It's the candy store. You guys, let's go back out to the shop. How are we making out, Bob? What are we working on? Is this a little stem there? We are working on a 100 year old piece of Algeria. Nice. It's going to be on the Elijah Cole line. But, uh, it's going to be a special one because it's 100 years old. Very, very nice. <laughs> We're getting there. Working on the stem. It'll get there. Sooner or later. Beautiful. Very, very nice. Yeah. It will be. Coming out sweet. <laughs> it will be. I love your uh, little glitter uh, sandpaper stick. You like that? Yeah, it's very, very fashionable. It matches your uh, your shirt. It's what all the best dressed <laughs> pipe makers are sporting these days. It's a... cool. And I just love this piece of machinery. I'm gonna swing it around. Check this out, guys. Look at this bad boy. How old is this, Bob? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> well, it's, it's pieces, right? You kind of piece this together? Yeah. Awesome. 20s, 30s vintage. 
How fast is that spinner? I have no idea. No? Maybe 1,700 RPMs. All right. Awesome. I love it. I love it. Very nice. We full restoration service here at Old Firehouse. Come on down. Come on down, guys. Bob's here every Saturday from what, 10 to 3, Bob? Roughly? Nine, 9 to 3. 9 to 3 every Saturday. So, not too many shops left in the area that. I don't think there are any of, anymore. <laughs> we'll supply this kind of service. Very, very rare. So, we're going to take advantage of this. Someone told me that they were going to take advantage of me one time. I live to regret that. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, you want to show that pipe off? That's beautiful. The one in your mouth. Show, show that off. That's the, we're going to show the grain off on that. It's a Peter Heeshan. Look at the blast on this pipe. Unbelievable. Ring grain all the way around. All the way down. Yep. Smokes like a dream. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, with the uh, Sherlock Holmes Pipe Club of Boston. Um, having a great time. This guy's going to tell you just a little bit of information about their club and uh, kind of what they're all about. And, uh, <laughs> And, uh, take it from there. All right, guys. You ready? Right. You ready? Are you Juan Nelson, secretary of the club? Eric Kahn, president of the club. Sherlock Holmes Pipe Club of Boston. SHPCBoston.org. And we hope you come and visit the webpage because we've got a lot of years worth of newsletters in there and a lot of experience from people in there. So it's a great place to start off. We've got a lot of links to starting out pipe smoking. And we're here with on National Pipe Smoking Day to celebrate with everybody. So what can we tell you about us? It's been around since 1989. And uh, I'm the, I think, the third iteration or fourth iteration of president. We don't change presidents too, easy, too quickly. Nobody wants it. <laughs> and what we're here primarily for, hey guy Joe, another member. We're being videos. Hey, oh, are we? Yeah. Joe? <laughs> yeah, Joe Travis. Joe Travis. Yep. <laughs> From the, Ro the Rhode Island contingent. <laughs> yeah, we're the, uh, we're the rebels. Yeah. We're is, is he uh, he's doing anybody else? We're being interviewed right now. Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse me. <laughs> this is nothing fancy, so we're just whatever. Yeah, he can speak we're we're just winging it. <laughs> yeah, we'll tell you. Anyway, now one thing we want to say is for those of you who are in the Massachusetts area uh, and, and can make it once a month down to our club, we welcome you. The uh, border barrier. Uh, club has uh, been on a little bit of an upswing in the last uh, six months, um, and we'd like to see it continue. So, uh, you know, we're, we're a great bunch of guys get together, we, we swap stories, we learn more about pipes, and try different types of tobacco. We have a tobacco raffle um, every month, a couple of tins. Um, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a great time. Uh, and where we, recommend it. where we meet is rather interesting. I can't officially tell you over the web <laughs> because we've been asked not to say but if you contact us at our email address on the web uh, we will be more than happy to give you directions as to how to get there and uh, why we're there as well. Great. Yeah, we have awesome. a special knock. I know. <laughs> and a handshake, right? <laughs> <laughs> Can't give yeah. that away. Yeah, it's funny looking hat. I don't know if he's on. Right. Uh, yeah, we've been around for quite some time now. Yeah. And like any other club, we're there primarily to promote pipe smoking among those who are already smokers or are desirous to become smokers of pipes. Yeah, that's awesome. I say that because we're not telling everybody you should go out and smoke a pipe. What we're saying is if you are interested, if you are already smoking a pipe, or maybe you want to switch from cigars or cigarettes, fine, come on down. It is a better way to smoke. I will not say it's a less expensive one, Definitely not. because pipe smoking becomes a hobby, and you can start anywhere from from eight dollars for a corn cob pipe and start going all the way up to the thousand, two thousand, three thousand dollar range for pipes. Yep. But it's remember, if you are considering smoking a pipe, you're smoking the tobacco inside the pipe. You're not smoking the pipe. I hope. And if that's the case, 
uh, a good pipe is really all you need. Yep. You don't have to have a, a five hundred or eight hundred dollar pipe. Although they're nice to have. Yeah. 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 If you have it, fine. If you want to get a really good pipe at a good price, you can check out this guy. Right here's Tim Heineck. He's a uh, he's our um, Tim? resident pipe smoker. Nice I mean pipe, pipe maker. Nice we all have pipes from Tim, and they are superb. Uh, Tim, do you have, do you have a, um, a website or? I don't have a website. Yeah, he's pretty low key. I'm pretty low key. Okay. Um, so again, go to, go to shpcboston.org. At the bottom, it says contact us and send, send me an email. Yep. What's that? What is that website again? Shpcboston.org. Okay. Um, it's our monthly newsletter. It comes out almost every month. Sometimes I, I I'm the one that puts a newsletter together. So right. sometimes I get lazy. I don't right. have enough. Uh, yep. Enough information. We for know how that bottom, is. At the bottom, there's a contact us, and uh, uh, that goes to a Yahoo account. Which, uh, again, I have got a reminder in my email to make sure I check it. Yep. And you know, by the way, if you, you go to that website, you go down to the bottom. We archive our old <laughs> newsletters, and emails, and that sort of thing. You can take a look. There's a lot of history there from a lot of people, and um, it, it's really kind of fun. Yeah, and we put our like broken, broken pipes, of course, go in there. We always want to remember our friends. What more can I tell you? Beautiful. Come on down. And it's a great place if you want to talk about politics. Oh, yeah. Because this guy loves Hillary Clinton. What? That can get dangerous. That can be very dangerous. No, 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 no. no. I call it Hillary, but that's beside the point. It's just coincidental how many of the friends that she used to have are dead now. Yep. That used to know her when. But again, that's politics. Politics, and I, I don't know <laughs> there. Yeah, he never talked about politics. Like, never. Or guns. And I, I never talked about guns. Either. And we do meet once in a while. We do meet at a gun club. Oh, cool. When the place nice. that we're going to is not available for one reason or another, uh -huh. we we'll go to a gun club. And yeah, if you are licensed and you want to shoot, there's usually somebody there, like me or yep. another member, who are members there. And we'll get you downstairs so you shoot. Awesome. I guess one thing we can yeah. say about the place where we do meet is it's pretty kosher, right? Very, yeah, it's very kosher. Very kosher. Very kosher. What are you guys? Uh, what are you guys smoking today? Yo. I'm smoking uh, H and H Old Dock Fired and, and a Mark Tinsky um, uh, SHPC Club Pipe. Beautiful Calabash. Thank you. And on my way out, I simply grabbed the Dark Flake Aromatic from Gowith and Hogarth in uh, an old Nording. Oh, and, that's, a Nording. Uh, really? that's a Nording. Okay. And I've been smoking that for the last so three or four hours. Nice. Because that's uh, that's the way I you know I don't believe if you have a well for me if I have a well working pipe with a good edge to it then I don't have to change my pipe every other bowl or something like that I can smoke that bowl all day long. Uh, let's see, how many pipes do you have? In the vicinity of a hundred. Oh, and I'm a piker. Oh, really? I don't have that many. I only have. I thought I was bad. <laughs> <laughs> I finally met somebody that's worse than me. I got three hundred. Three hundred, really? Plus. Oh my God. And I, I'm trying not to grow it. When can I come over? I'm sorry. I come, what? I want to come over. I will. <laughs> Go. You want to come over? Yeah. Sorry, they were on the lock and key. <laughs> you more than you said. Oh, yes, awesome, guys. Thank you. you know, right. Thank you. Thanks for uh, giving us your time. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What you should do is come down to one of our meetings and just have a good time there. Absolutely. Yeah, you're more than welcome. We're definitely going to do that. First Tuesday of the month uh, at uh, typically 7, 7.30. We get started. But if you, if you want to catch, if you want to catch up with us without knowing where we are, we have a group that meet at Sidney Perkins at the Tobacco Shop in um, Cop Corner in Canton, which is not too far from where we meet. So we're usually there between five and six. We have some dinner after that, and then we go over to the meeting. And you guys have a uh, a Facebook um, page also? Yep. Uh, got this guy. Right here. He just put, he just put it together. Just put it together. Uh, Sherlock uh, Holmes Pipe Group. Uh, no, Pipe Sherlock Club Holmes Pipe Club of Boston. Okay. On the Facebook. It's easy to spell. It's easy to look yeah. up. That's the Facebook. We just right. recently we had an old one, but and we I think you have a link to the webpage in there too, don't you? 
I believe I do, yes. Yeah. So, oh, sweet. check us out there as well. Plenty of ways to get in contact with you guys. Absolutely. Plenty of ways. Absolutely. Social media is great. <laughs> and if you like short stories, we've got a guy who writes short stories using pipes. Really? Yes, we do. Oh, my God. His name's Ernie. It's like pipe heaven. Yeah. <laughs> we try to pull it all together. <laughs> yep. So happy International Pipe Smoking Day. Thanks, folks. guys. Come and take care. Thanks. Thank you very much. That's Bob working on over here. We're walking over his shoulder. Now, what are you doing, Bob? Oh, he's still working on that pipe. Okay. We're still hanging out. We'll get back. We'll get back at you guys. All right. And Derek, after you're done, we get a link to your YouTube. Absolutely. So that we can link it. Yep. No problem. I was not going to do that. Thanks. Thank you very much. What kind of pipe is that, Bob? That's an Ashton. Oh, it's an Ashton, really? A Bill Taylor Ashton. I wanted an Ashton. Very hard to come by a Bill, a Bill Taylor Ashton. Is that uh, just Triple E you're hitting on right now? Or? This is just kind of new, but it's... Oh, you're hitting with wax? Okay. Yeah. Kind of jumped in the middle. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little late. That's fine. Nice. Yeah, he just gets right in there. That's just a six inch. This, what is that, six inch? That six have? inch, not even. Uh, yeah, probably six inch. Yeah, I'm spinning my wheels way too fast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you want to be able, when you're spinning, you want to be able to. Stop it. Well, you just don't right. want the resistance. Right. Don't burn it up. Let the buff do the work. You know? yep. See, when you're buffing and you smell rubber, there's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Beautiful Ashton. Isn't it nice? That's gorgeous. Is that blasted? Can you, can you show that off? This is blasted. Um, I forgot what he called it. Uh, Brendel Triple X. Nice. It's very difficult to, I mean, Bill Ash and Bill Taylor, uh, he has all kinds of categories and grades and stuff, and it's kind of like Dunhill, almost like trying to find out. Right, right. Um, this is definitely a blast. Um, I don't know if they call that a pebble grain or, um, I'm not sure. I just know it makes it very nice, but... Very, very nice. What's going on, YouTube? Still hanging out. What a great day so far. And the funny thing is, is you let them know that by relating to their humans. Still smoking my Brebbia Calabash. And they realize that you know that they don't they, it's like it's, they control and dominate the business, but don't want anyone to know that they control and dominate the business. And I don't know why. I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of like I told my said. First time I've ever had this blend, and man, it's incredible. Really nice. Yes, they do, Grandma. I said, why don't people get up and say, just hanging out. Check out all these pipes, guys. Pipe heaven. Just hanging out, having a little uh, little libation. Just chilling out. Huh? I'm wondering if this is a
finest Virginia tobacco is actually blended with Latakia to give the smoker a unique taste. I mean, you can make the, anything, really. Okay. You don't care? Really? You don't know how somebody cares. There you go. We do it We like to do a tasting every once in a while. No, no, no. Okay. But I mean, at least that's uh, yeah. No, it's, yeah. it's like, I mean, that product is going to be the best part is that it goes like a shank. I mean, it's one right, it's one left. Check out these pipes, guys. Beautiful specimens. To make your mouth water. Sorry for the lighting in here, guys. A little dark. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. It's a I love this pipe right here. Really, you know, if you're on that trendy pipe, you know, it's Cabernet. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, well. I smoked that had it for a long time. Can you adjust your price for inflation? Look at this. Absolutely gorgeous. Smooth top. I'm going to show you up. Our door blowfish. <laughs> Look at that. That's incredible. That is unique. Very, very cool. Beautiful beer shop. Very, very nice. I have my eye on this one, guys. I really like this one. I might go home with this one today. It's beautiful Peterson. Love it. I've been eyeing this one for months. Very, very nice. the finish on the, the finish on those pipes is very good. Are you the this is very nice. This is very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice. Buttered rum. Love that stuff. This is interesting. Might try some of that. Hmm, that sounds very intriguing. 
This is a very aggressive, this is like a brown, almost gray to a point kind of consistency. I mean, they don't smoke either, but if you're a I left mine in the in the Ziploc bag for months and it's still wet. Yeah, it's really nice. And I'm not a big aromatic fan, just because I think I smoke too fast. And I burn my mouth, you know. Well I try to roll this baby's bottom that Bruce brought in. And it's a it's a match. The one H and H makes it's not done though. Packing up some bangle slices here. The inaugural bangle slices. Sweet. Yeah, nice. Dine and try this stuff. Okay, I read it. Yeah, buddy. I saw you looking around. I saw you fishing. You look at the grain of some of those briars. Mm -hmm. Hey, make it out, John. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on YouTube? Pipe Leisure. Just ending out the spectacular day here at Old Firehouse. I'm just getting ready to get into my truck. It's like 5.30. Gonna head home. Um, awesome day, man. Met so many great people. I just wanna thank everybody that came out. Um, the Sherlock Pipes, uh, Pipe Club of, of Boston was um, incredible. What an awesome group of guys. Uh, probably gonna go up next, next month for one of their meetings and um, just uh, join them and see what they have to offer and just hang out. Um, some of us from the shop here are gonna, gonna do that. Um, so I'm really looking forward to doing that. So try to try so many great blends today. Everybody just brought so much stuff. It was incredible. Um, probably my probably my favorite out of the whole day was the Bengal slices. I'm going home right now and I'm ordering like five tens of that. Incredible. Um, if you guys haven't tried the bangle slices, nice, nice blend. Really enjoyed it. I think after I tried it, I just stayed with it for the rest of the rest of the evening. So very, very, very happy with that. Um, but other than that, man, it was a great turnout. Um, International Pipe Smoking Day 2016 was by far um, an incredible day, and I can't wait for next year. So, probably gonna do it again here next year. Same place, same time. So, uh, looking forward to it. And now I, um, I guess I gotta do some editing with all these little clips that I did and uh, make a video. Um, that's about it. And head home, grab something to eat. I'm freaking starving. I haven't eaten all day, so I'm gonna do that. But, um,. I just want to apologize for some of the video. I, it was a little louder in there. It was loud in there today, so um, I'm hoping that the audio came out okay. Uh, we'll see. Maybe I'll be able to adjust it a little bit with uh, some editing software. I don't know. We'll see. See how I make out with that. But, um, just want to thank everybody. Thanks for uh, watching this video, guys. And uh, until next time. Um, We'll catch up with you. Thanks for watching, guys. 
Bye.